Hello everyone, welcome back to Altria's Place Quake 2. This is Ground Zero. Um, I've come back to where I was just before I died, and I'm here because I kept trying to jump over this, and I kept managing it. <laughs> which, and then I can't do it now, and I don't want to go the long way around, but I think I, I, what I've done there, just as you can see, is I've killed that... Um, what do they call it? Stop doing this. The, uh, what did they call it, actually? I don't know why I want to use it, do I? Gladiator. I kept trying to say Centurion. I feel like Gladiator that had the airstrike. Uh, who's now up there. Oh yeah, you're thinking I can't see you. Ow. Rude ass. <laughs> uh, and I'm probably going to die again. But I've saved recently, so that's good. Uh, should we just... Whoa. Hello? None of that, please. Uh, what was I saying? Right. There's a... Uh, there's this dude just shooting a bit. You seem too easy. Uh, that thing's dead. I'm scared. I'm gonna die. Oh, there's another one. I guess we just keep exploding. Yep. Uh, and I'm pretty sure there was another one. What's the other one I've got in here? Nothing. Okay. Yeah. Um... <laughs> Get there. I'm sorry for my stunted. Uh, I can't remember the word commentary today, but um, I've actually forgotten how to play this game and it's terrifying. And I'm on very low health, and I can hear that I'm about to get very much got by something. So I'm being quiet and careful. In the hope that I can sort of make my way through this without running out of health before I get to pick any more up. There we go, there we go. I'm actually going to save it at that point. That's a. Uh, I've earned that, I think. Oh, look, a big lake of lava. <laughs> when is this game ever not giving us a big lake of lava? It also gives me the opportunity to jump down here and see what's in it. Now, um, I've been talking about what we can do for the next. Uh, maybe the next series the next thing we do after Quake 2, because we're, I think we're not too far away from this, right? We can't, we can't do anything here. I'm just, just exploring. That's what saving is for. And um, I've had a great suggestion of perhaps trying uh, Fallout 2. Specifically 2. I'm guessing the reasons Fallout 2 was suggested is that Fallout... Obviously Fallout 3 is not that retro, although it's kind of retro at this point. Um, I don't think it's quite as retro as... Um, what did I just pick up? Uh, not quite as retro as maybe Quake 2. When did Fallout 3 come out? Tell me that and um, we'll see if it fits. But um, Fallout 2, it's presumably better than Fallout 1. I tried playing Fallout 1 a little bit, um, but I didn't get into it. And I think I was a little bit scared. <laughs> I was scared of the game. The reason I was scared of the game is that equipment failure. Oh no! The... Um, the, the entire mission is timed. I've never noticed how ugly you are. Um, you have a certain amount of days to retrieve spoilers. Um, to, to, I think, fix the water or something very similar to Fallout 3. To sort out the... Whatever the problem is that the, the bunker has decided to befall. Oops, I completely jerked my mouse that quick, but it's not how you play the game. Um, so... Yeah, I found it really a little bit... It was just too much anxiety. <laughs> I didn't know if I was going to sort of run out of time whilst playing the game by perhaps exploring too much, because it's a Fallout game. <laughs> and that's what you're supposed to do, is over-explore. And overcommit, and then at the end of the game, well, oh, no, I'm going to time. I haven't managed to do everything I needed to do. Um, game over. So I don't want to play a game where I have to start again because at some point, right at the beginning, I screwed it up. But you know what I mean? It's a little bit like um, what Just Try Pace keeps mentioning actually, which is 
Because these... Ooh. Okay. We've done that. Oh, crap. We're okay. I think the rock is mine. Uh, which is, there's these old text adventure games, and presumably some non-text adventure games as well, but the problem, the thing that they would do is that, uh, Hitchhikers, I'm looking at you. If at the start of Hitchhiker, uh, Hitchhiker's Guide to the Galaxy, the computer game, which was a completely text-based game, if you didn't do the right thing, as soon as the game started, like, almost in the first scene, basically it was in the second scene, um, then when you will, when the whole story came round, you would be sort of locked out. You wouldn't be able to do the thing that you need to do. Um, but how are we going to fix this equipment failure? I've placed... Reprogram and destroy. I've placed it. Why are you not acknowledging my bravado and... Okay. Um, and you'd have to basically play literally the entire game again. This is Zot, is it? Zot? Zot? So... I don't want that to be the case for Fallout 1. I don't know what the plot of Fallout 2 is. I haven't actually played it, but I do have it. So if there's one thing that suggesting a game is going to, you know, uh, be... Hang on. The grammar of this sentence is completely wrong. There's going to be one thing about a game that means suggesting it is going to be a good suggestion. It's, there we go. It's, this game's going to be a good suggestion. Um, how do I speak English? Then it's going to be... Oh, dear. Um... Suggesting what I've already got. <laughs> okay, so we've uh, reprogrammed this gun by pushing this, and it is blowing a hole in its own silo. <laughs> we've placed the thing next to the thing. Okay. So now you're gonna airstrike into it. Incoming game. Do you know what they should make a game out of? Reboot. Have you seen it? The, it's a Canadian show. Three, two, Taking place inside a computer. It's very... What? <laughs> okay. Uh, let's do that again. It's a Canadian show. Sit inside a computer. Kids show. Um, and every now and then it would say, Warning incoming game. And there would just be this massive blue cube that would descend upon the computer city. Which would be the user of Computer playing a game. That's warning and coming game. Uh, it's right there in the name. But, um, so, first of all, ow. Uh, second of all, that wasn't. Ah! I see. You actually saw it move, I just wasn't paying attention. Um, uh, the, the user would play a different flipping game every single time, right? It was a disruptor. It's a second BFG. It's insane. So we've got the airstrike marker. I want to know what this does now. But I don't know when to use it. Maybe just let's open this door. Let's open this door and fire this thing. I want to know. Just. What? It's got its own. What? It's not a second BFG. It's got its own ammo. <gasps> Um, the, yeah, the user would never play the same game twice, which is crazy. Well, what sort of kid, I guess, would not play the same game twice? Of course it was a kid. It was the 90s. Only children played video games. Um, but the cool thing about it was that any denizen of the reboot universe that was... Um, ah, keep doing that. Underneath the game when it landed would be part of the game. And honestly, it was extremely dangerous. Every time the game landed, they were trying to get the, the user to fail. Because if they didn't, some unknown consequence would befall them if the, you know, if the player won the game. But presumably, every time they uh, <laughs> won the game, they go, oh, screw it, then. Uh, I'm never playing this again. Well, the they lost. I don't get it, but the fact that the denizens would be part of it, it's its kind of a cool concept, basically, what I'm saying. I'm getting the uh, credit for doing the explosion. Look at that, see that? 
Last time we saw this, it went round in a weird circle. Oh, there we go. Oh! Okay, I'll see you in a minute. <laughs> Are you serious? Yeah, I keep standing here and watching it. It doesn't matter where I am. <laughs> I'm gonna go out here. This is the only correct place to be, apparently. Can we watch it from somewhere else? Can we watch it from here? Roger that yeah, no. I'm not gonna. It's not make me. I'm gonna run around and wait. The, 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 the counting is out of sync. We don't get to watch it. We saw it the first time. Now we get to go. Proceeds to waste present. Oh, I see. It's kind of bright. <laughs> Enter from above. Excuse me? We have to now smash that pipe that I thought we couldn't break. Why don't I look inside? Let's go and see. Let's go and see. Whoa! That lift moves so fast that I wasn't even on it. <laughs> There's nothing. Huh? I hoping it would be like insanely OP. Did we find the secret? There's two secrets. That's going to be a secret. How do we deal with that? Is it a grenade in there? What could go wrong? Have we even been in this? We haven't been here yet. Really? Ooh. Ow. Does this one explode next part? Ah, it's broken. <laughs> I love how I just said look up. Oh, yeah, okay. Yeah, I did. So that is the... I don't know how to find a secret in this level. Kind of not too worried. Let's think about it another time. Ah! Whoa, secrets. <laughs> that is an elaborate secret, but I love it. I need to turn it off. Ha ha ha, found one. Glad to put the effort in, is this the second one? Okay. Almost looks like it could be, just based on the way that's lined up. I don't want there to be a second like, why can't there be a second one? <laughs> Who puts a secret button behind a pillar and then it explodes a pipe that then doesn't do anything else? Alright, well, we found one of them, that's good enough. Oh, I remember that. Remember that? It was useless. Why have you given me this thing? I'll see you in the next level. Or at least in the, the path to the next level. Yeah, it's broken. Alrighty, oh, I guess we're going in here. Uh. Ow, by the way. Doesn't look like there's any way of this being used, right? I'm not even sure that is. Maybe it's an, <clears throat> a vowel. Some sort of vowel. It's like Banjo Kazooie. What's happening? Well, more guaranteed damage. Oh, next level. Gain access to the waste disposal. Point. Is this disruptor, by the way, supposed to be some sort of. Um... Hey, what? It's like a. Gravy? A black hole Something like that? What happens if I actually hit something with it? 
This is weird. <laughs> the enemies have regressed in power. What? I kind of want to find out. Not really sure what that is. <laughs> See me looking up at that thing going, hey, that looks suspicious. Yeah, that was suspicious. Ah, I thought, I thought you couldn't see me anymore. Put my hands over my ass, that means you can't see me. The flatter piece of skull or whatever it's called. Skull? Sounds about right. You took one of them. save it once in a while. I hate them. I don't know why they have to still be part of the game. We've moved on. We're mature now. Okay. I'm going to press 8. But I, think. I pressed 7 and 8 at the same time, both times. I'm kind of not proud of myself. This is a bit of a mess. I feel like we don't need to be here. Our job's already been done. Okay. It's just water and then there's just this lava. Can you explain why you built on lava? And hmm. How many waste disposal plants can there be in, on the stroke planet? I mean, I guess several. There's many on this planet, but... You know what? Screw you guys. I even got a pesky, pesky thing. Yeah. I can hear you. Can I actually? Oh, yeah. <laughs> nice. Send grenades through a laser. Systems in active, right? Well, I won't do that. I can tell because they're these trucks should be pumping. Okay. I don't know you're there because you're always flipping there. <laughs> I love it when they get stuck. Pools. You're happy, you're excited to... Ooh, hello. Gladiator. Ow. Can you please take damage from... Yeah. I'm trying to hit you with these grenades. Ah! Missing. Good job, well done. Uh, probably not the... I was going to say not the best use of a med kit, but look at my health. It's over the top down. Get a bit more. I don't know where. Here. Can I just like maybe wait this thing up? <laughs> Put somebody up. 
Come on in. 32 of 83 points. Yeah, that's how we speak in, in English. 32. What's it worth? It's a quantity. It's a quantity. I'm reminded that when I was a kid, I... There's a lot of... It's, it sucks being the smart kid in the primary school, right? Because... I'm remembering so many things. First of all, I remember trying to explain to people what such as meant. As in... Give me an example, right? You'd say something, and then they would say, such as. And then you're supposed to provide an example. That's what that means. Right? And they were like, what's that? <laughs> what does he mean? Right? Why don't you know this word? How old are you? Has nobody said this to you yet? Do, do standard issue parents not use words like this? It's just a normal word. What's the matter with you? There was another incident where they wouldn't believe me that you should put the knife and fork the other way around on the other side of the table. <laughs> Look. Is this a bad thing to do? This is a bad thing to do. Um, and when I say the other way around, I mean the same way around from an adult's understanding. But like, not directly opposite, but swap them so the knife and fork are on the same relative side of the human being. Right, I'll press the lift button. Jeez. Can't. Good. Just do this thing. Um, and then what I was reminded, what reminded me of all of that, I have now forgotten, actually. <laughs> what was I saying? Oh my god. I'm confused by this whole game. Hmm. What were we talking about? Tell me what we're talking about, and I'll remember what it was I was going to say. It was something dumb that kids would do by not understanding simple concepts, and I was a smart guy. If I remember, I'll tell you. Something about Alva Bravo, Charlie. Do you know your ABCs? Whoa. I hate that I've forgotten, actually. <laughs> My brain was so interested in telling you about all the stuff that I remember as a kid, like being a smart kid. It's in primary school. That's the, that's the worst bit, right? You can be the smart kid in secondary school and people believe you, but in primary school they think and argue with you about simple things. What was I even talking about at the time? That's the question. Uh, hey, please. Hello. Hey, I'll have to go back and watch the recording and tell you in the next episode. <laughs> as soon as I work it out, I promise you, you'll be the first. Player. There's nothing like a bit of splash damage to sort out a problem that you can't sort out with line of sight. Was it when I was talking about how we say words? Oh, hello. <laughs> I'm expecting it to be there. What was I saying? 30 something? I don't know how we talk and then should stop. Yeah. I'll figure it out. Don't worry about it. There's a very important story that I tell you, obviously. Um, the, the series can't end without you all having heard the anecdote of, of grave importance. Imagine not knowing. Just, just picture yourself in a world where you don't know what I was going to say. I know. Exactly. Well, hello. <laughs> Made me jump, but that's okay. I forgot to think about the fact that enemies are just... I was distracted. I had a very distracted day today. Full on ADHD today. Yeah, run through the lasers that you can't see, obviously, because they're... <laughs> Not like really obviously right there or anything. Any weirdos? I can see it. Okay, I just don't know how. Ooh. There we go. It was broken. That was the trick. Boop. Oh, that seems handy. Oh, the baddies can get through. 
the reactor. That's, the filtration system is off because there's no power, but you just said filtration system's inactive. So there's no power. Let me know if you think that Fallout 3 is retro enough to be retrovated. And let me know if you want to see any like, modern games, because I was enjoying playing Minecraft, but it just takes so blinking long. Defender Sphere, so that must be this stuff, right? Maybe not. I don't know what he does. <laughs> okay. so, hello. What does it do? By the way, please. Is this going to be a case of shoot one, another one pops out, and I just have to keep playing? Hello. Where are you? Hello. Hello. <laughs> I want to be in the line of sight of Tahuta. That these jokes can't be done. That joke could Hello. <laughs> Bye. Whoa. Too many turrets. Too many ninjas. Remember too many ninjas? That was a good one. Simple flash 2D game. I'll let you off for that one. That's really good. I did just stand there and wait for you to stop to hootering at me. Whoa. I was talking about her. Um... You boot, right? Still seems like a good thing to do. Hello. Uh, the idea of a super so the, the I'm pretty sure that the the programs, I guess they were, that were in the game when the game landed in reboot died. If they died, and it's like if you die in the game, you die in real life. Except real life, you're a computer game. You're already a computer, so it's not real. Um, it's a certain Tron Well. Keep ducking is going to help. This is this has got a bit intense. It's also about time to finish the episode. I know that I will have cut some things out, but I... Half an hour is half an hour, right? Give or take. It's always going to be give or take. Hopefully more give than take. And when I play back through... Well, here's the thing. I don't know if I'm going to play back through the episode straight away. I'll just record another one. Maybe I'll have a quick look at what I was talking about. I really want to know what it was I was going to say. Even if you don't want to know what I was going to say, I do. So, I'll see you next time. Thank you for watching. Um, I'm going to push this button at the start of the next episode. So if you want to see that, then you better subscribe, leave a like, join me on Mastodon, any of those things, all of those things, it's all brilliant. Um, and let me know what you think about Fallout 3 as a retro game. Fallout 2 definitely seems like a good idea. I've never actually played it. And Fallout 1, I could also try that one, but, you know, let's see where we go. Uh, one of these is a good idea, so let's do that one. And until next time, I'll thank you for watching, and I will see you then. Bye!